it has been an amazing week here in my studio. Not only did I get to start my new series, Hidden Worlds, and using coffee, but it was also Valentine's Day, which meant my husband and I uh, went and bought some delicious chocolate from our favorite bakery. So it was amazing. Chocolate and coffee. Who could want more? Stay tuned and I'll tell you all about it. I chose uh, to experiment first on two papers, 11 by 14 inch. Of course, I like to do a lot of mark making uh, as my first layer. One paper has no gesso and the other does have gesso. And the idea was just to try and understand how the coffee would apply to each and how the color of the coffee would look on a non-gessoed and gessoed surface. You can see me here rubbing in a dry coffee in, first of all, the paper without gesso and the paper with gesso. As expected, the coffee went on very differently on the paper with gesso. Both were really messy, but they really smelled good. Here I am taking coffee water and applying it like I would paint. And um, that was lots of fun. Uh, but the color wasn't as intense as I had hoped it would be. This is on the non gessoed the gessoed paper here. Sorry, yes, this is the gessoed paper. And then uh, just after, I did finish a couple of paintings in the studio as well. I, um, a day or so later, I started to do some more mark making and paint on the two little paintings I'd already started. Uh, this is the first painting has no gesso on it, and I'm applying some oil pastel, white oil pastel, and then a little bit of red because uh, it reminds me, of course, of uh, red coffee berries. Next, I'm just fooling around, playing with some colors, and just bringing some interest to the painting. This uh, is, of course, you the paper with the gesso. You can see it looks quite different than the painting without the gesso. It also, once again, it feels different, and some of the coffee grounds got caught in the gesso paper. And uh, once again, applying some of the same colors just to see how it will look. And uh, here we are with the red again. I decided to do an 18 by 24 inch painting uh, following the coffee theme and trying to integrate some of the things I had learned doing the two smaller studies. Uh, please check in with me next time and we'll see how the coffee paintings turned out. Thanks. Bye-bye.